You are watching What About Games Let's Play Jesus The Walking Dead Episode 2 Start for Hell. In our channel, there are awesome videos, and uh, um, our most recent review is What About Gaming Quack Shot for Sega Genesis. Go check it out, you're gonna like it. I am Jesus, and this is What About Gaming Let's Play with Jesus. Ow! Hello, this is Jesus from What About Gaming and this is What About Gaming's Let's Play Jesus The Walking Dead Episode 2 Star for Help. Well, ah, Star for Help, I mean. Uh, so yeah, in the last in and this is part 5 for the last play. In the part 4 or the last part for the last play we have entered the evaded the bandits camp and um, yeah. So and uh, there was a woman trying to kill me. She was pointing like a crossbow in my head. And I I have to choose. I have to choose to kill her or to let to or to let her live. And uh, but the, that the stupid guy the farm. I I think it's Danny or Dan whatever. He killed him and I told him not to kill her. Maybe she was Mother Clementine. That's at least what I think. Uh, yeah, and she stole the head from from Clementine. Um, so now, um, yeah, let's uh, let's see what happens. This is the cow that um, Katya is taking care it's of. Okay, Clementine, you can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see. Clementine. Oh, so she's not sick. So the cows Danny said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did she lick it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> she did. There's something in the store. Okay, so the cows isn't sick. She's just having a baby tonight. Cool. In spite of all of those, uh, uh, yeah, in spite of the, uh, all of those uh, things that happen, the bad things that happen. Let's stay close to your mouth for now. Okay. <laughs> See, if she was, she was like, oh, I'm playing the hay. Uh, no, not a good idea. Maybe you just should, should stay for a mother right now. And he was like, okay, then I'll do it then. What do I have to do? Look at Dairy Box. This is the same box. Oh, it doesn't really matter because I am the Dairy, so yeah. Something on this door? Oh, uh, it's locked. You found it too, huh? They're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff. Something metal. Man, this shot. guy is going to... Don't get paranoid. Yeah, that's what I, I was going to say. Come he was going to... Right now. He's being How paranoid, so... Yeah. About Clem? He says that everyone is hiding something. She's not actually family. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya. What's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. Yeah, use okay, our head. Professor, what'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Okay, I have, I have to pick the lock. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? Uh, no. no. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban. Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry.
I don't wanna do this. I am going to lose to See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. But I think this is not a good idea. You are being stupid. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? No, we're okay. Can you hear the noise? Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. It's not a good idea to pick this lock. Distract Andy to get him out of the barn. Open stall door. What's that bitch? Oh, something here? We barrel. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Smells pretty foul. Yeah. Smells like. Yeah. Uh, do I really have to do this? The game isn't giving me much so much, much choice than to pick the door and check what's behind the thing. It's a feeding trough. Again, I think it's not a good idea to... to what? Why did he close the door? There's some fence posts. What? A fence post, okay. Talk to Doug. Hey, Doug. Have I missed anything? No, not really. That's funny here. Well, like manure. What's manure? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kids. Hey, um, Clementine, I have your hat. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Like that okay, okay, the same line, you just press the wrong button. My hat! You found it! I... yeah, I... You knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor who might have taken it? No. Why? Are you? Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Amy, do you think you'll ever have kids? I haven't thought about it in a while. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clint. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Yeah, but you go on here. Let's, uh... I have to distract Andy and uh, let's uh, look at the cow and see what she has she to do. She looks skinny. Yeah, maybe she didn't eat, she didn't eat four days, so yeah. How do you like that cow, Clint? Yeah, the wrong, no, that's not the, I was trying to talk to, oh, I can't talk to you. I thought there was a, a button showing a, but an option to talk to uh, Katya, but no, it was wrong. Okay, Kenny, I think we you weren't giving me much so much. Yeah. You are you weren't giving me giving me much choice. So it seems that I that I'll have to do it anyway. Yeah. But before um, let's talk to Kenny again. Thank you. 
instruct Andy. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Yeah. If he could really listen to what I'm saying right now, I would say it's a bad idea to 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 put to put your nose where you want you want welcome. So yeah. No, Anza, woman like yourself on this whole place. Oh, I managed just come. Plus, I had my boys take a break. How could you? Yeah, she's like he's like a She, he's going, he's going well with the, with the, with, uh, with Brenda. I think that's her name, Brenda. Oh, let's just, again, let's just distract the, let's distract Andy and let's, let's screw up everything and lose our food forever. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? Yeah, there's something wrong with the bar. Can you fix their height or something? Nah, no, you think the same? Just be careful. What what can you what can you argue about? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. When I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get on the way to go. And I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I'm thinking and starting to think they may be hiding something. Do I really have to say that to her? Not now. Watch yourself, Lee. Because if I say that, she's going like to kill me. What? If we, if you just, if you try to get in someone, they are, you are going to lose. We are going to lose our food forever. But Kenny, Kenny is being a, is going. Going paranoid and saying, "Okay, they are hiding something," but I say, "No, they aren't. No, and they and he is. They are." And I say again, "They aren't." Let's uh, talk to uh, Hey Larry and Brenda. Yeah, what you want here? He did the big old sweet hurting. Uh, don't know if I'm going to use those words. <laughs> don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll pay to go and sit down here and mail me in. What do you guys keep in the barn? How's Mark doing there? How's Mark doing there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on it. You're going to have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. What do you guys keep in their barn? Is it a good idea to ask this? So... Getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to cry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Yeah, it kind of makes sense. We run some trouble. We ran into trouble. Let's say that you killed the... I'm just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. And if, uh, uh, the the Andy, Andy, or them, you met a woman. Why do you give these bandits? We got a flat of humanity left, Lee. We can do more good without them in our hair by placating them. So that's what we do. They gotta go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here. Enjoy while you can. You'll probably stop hearing those monsters trying to get some dance with them too far. The monsters are walkers. Talk to you, okay? 
There's one. Are we ready? What's on your mind, man? We're going to be ready. You should be ready before too hard. Okay. She isn't giving the game isn't giving me much option of what to do. Of what to do. Uh, and I look at swing. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. And here's Danny. Hey Danny. Uh pretty why did you kill her? Hiding something over the barn. He, yeah, he knows that I know, but he won't. Is, he won't. Something at the barn field. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we to stay here. Yeah. So where's Larry? Oh, Larry, you're here. So Larry, it uh, looks like you get a little bit better. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? I'm just... I'm just saying that you are getting to stay along with someone else and just argue, arguing with everybody in the group. I'm thinking... I'm starting to think they may be hiding something, but not right here. I have to, uh, check outside... Look, uh... Kenny wants me to pick to pick the lock on the bar, and and um, and see what's behind the bar. But but I said to him that it was it wasn't a good idea, and he's going paranoid. Like no, you, we have to enter there. We have to check in what's inside. Oh, I hate him so much. I hate when he does that. I can turn off the I can turn off the generator. And what is that? A toolbox. What's inside this toolbox? It's a small toolbox. And there's also a here. We wait for a couple of tools and when he opens his own see this it gets a little bit fun in here. It would have been nice to have one of these back in the motor. So uh, I have to talk to, to Lily to say they are hiding, I think they are hiding something and she's going like, I don't know man, just, I, I just want to eat and go away. Uh, so inside the toolbox is a screwdriver, obviously it's a screwdriver inside the toolbox, and to get the attention of Danny, to make him go out, 
to check what's wrong with the generator. I have to turn off the gen generator. You're just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. Yeah, she feels the same, but... Watch yourself, Lee. She thinks it is a stupid idea to 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 pick the lock and oh man, the game isn't re really giving me much choice. What if they find that that I'm picking the lock? And if there is something really worth hiding there, they're going to kill me. They're going to kill someone the crew. You know, what would be really bad if they killed Clementine, like, for a, as an accident? So he said the two box we have the screwdriver. Not a screwdriver, but we have uh, pliers. Yeah, would I do? That is useful to, to, to remove these, to, to remove these screws from the, uh, from the door at the bar. Now I have to turn off the generator. Again, not a good idea. Power switch. Bad. You know what? Let's just check. Oh, let's check the electric fence. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came up. Oh, there is electricity. I thought it was off. So I have to turn off the generator and tell Danny that the generator isn't working. Power switch. Power switch. What? The? So now since there's... Oh, he's going out to check what's wrong. Dang, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Okay, he went back, so... It didn't really distract him. So I don't know what to do. Uh, maybe I have to talk him, talk to him on the barn. Okay, Andy, I thought it was Danny. Danny is the guy that killed the the woman uh, back at the uh, back the. Bad this guy. I and I told him not to kill her, but he did it. Talk to Andy. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Danny mentioned he needs something. Where do you keep your tools? Why do you lock the door? Why do you lock the door? Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while and raid our stuff, even with the things. Where do you keep your tools? So, where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need some, just tell me what it is and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Then he mentioned he needs something. Then he mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. You right back, Doc. What do I do now? Maybe if I go outside and turn off the generator. What did he do? Also on. I'm back. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Then he needs something again. Alrighty then. Hey there, Andy. Is this a, a glitch? Maybe I wasn't supposed to go outside, so I froze the game. And he keeps trying to distract me. Keep 
keeps coming back. There's gotta be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? Yeah, we can turn off the generator, but again, he keeps turning, he keeps coming back. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good here. But still, we have to distract him. If I say that Andy is, st then he still needs something. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Alrighty then. Okay, let's go outside and turn off the generator. No, wrong, wrong place. Okay, if I turn off the generator, he's going to see and he turns turns on the generator again and goes back inside the uh, in the bar. I have no idea what to do now. I'm really stuck in, in this part of the game. Power switch. Uh, back. And now Andy goes out and... Oh, th this thing turns off all the time. What's wrong with this? Again? I, I think I can do that one more time and maybe he's going to get another generator just to fix the thing. Hey, Danny. Hello. I'm going to go wait for supper there. It'll be a good one. And I don't, I don't have any idea what to do. Turn off the generator again. Okay, you know what? This has been... What about gaming's Let's Play Jesus The Walking Dead Episode 2 Start for Hell Part 5 I'm your host Jesus signing out Bye